When it comes to ghosts, paranormal, and anything to do with hauntings, there's always that one place that everybody thinks of first, and that is a cemetery, where the deceased lay and spirits are free to roam. We are at Pine Hill Cemetery, AKA Blood Cemetery. This location is deemed one of the most haunted locations in all of New England. I took you to this location today to specifically point out an experience that changed my life forever. It is because of an experience that I had on these grounds that I am the founder of New Hampshire Project Paranormal. Come with me into Blood Cemetery so I can tell you what happened to me right in these grounds. I am standing now with the family of the Bloods, in which one particular grave comes to mind, and one particular grave, that of a man who is said to haunt this entire cemetery. His grave is right here. His name is Abel Blood. His gravestone, that has obviously now been vandalized, when it was intact, had a hand that would point up like this to heaven. It is said by many paranormal investigators, not by myself, I've never validated this, but it's said that in nighttime, a lot of times when they would come investigate this place, the hand would be pointing down. Now I, like I said, can't validate that, but it is a local folklore that's been going around for many, many years. This grave is now gone and we'll never be able to tell fully if that was true or not. Now the experience that I had over here, I'm not gonna say it was for sure able blood, but I'm gonna tell you what happened to me right over here. Come with me. It is this tree right here where I had a face-on-face -face experience with that of an old man. He was wearing a top hat, he was very, very skinny, and he was in a full suit, as if it was his funeral suit, I don't know, but a full suit. And what I had saw was I saw him leaning like this against the tree, looking at me. I'm about 10 feet in front of where I am right now. I turned around. As I'm walking this way, I turned around like this, and he was staring at me. We made eye contact, and as soon as I realized what I was looking at, it disappeared. It vanished right before my eyes. Now, there's two reasons why I took you here to tell you my story. The first of which is just to show you an experience that changed my life forever, and an experience that made me fully believe in the paranormal. This is what sparked a fire under my ass and got me to start NHPP. Another reason is because I want to validate this experience that I had. So I'm looking for anybody who has been to Blood Cemetery and had a similar experience to please let me know. I know a lot of you have had similar experiences in the paranormal, not necessarily at Blood Cemetery, but I felt that everybody should hear my story. What, what sparked my interest in the paranormal? Well, the man that was standing right here, that's who did it. And I want to 